deflecting responsibility for your mistakes? How pathetic. You should start over as a prinny. Were you abandoned because you're so weak? In that case, you're just like Desco. I'll give you a little bit of my sympathy. Oh well, I think this experience will help you grow stronger anyway. I was pretty much neglected growing up too. Kids grow up to be tougher when they have harsher upbringings, you know? You say that so casually. Were you abandoned too? Uh-huh. I mean, it was basically the same thing. He's the worst dad ever. Big sis. <laughs> A bond among neglected children. Looks like our party is knitting together tighter than ever. Prasco, you're not going to give up now, are you? Does your existence completely rely on your identity as the president's son, after all? But father discarded his only son. I guess he got tired of me. Since his death, I have yet to take a single human soul. Would you prefer to die? Die? Me? Right now? No! No, no way! Then fight! You died once, so fight back as if you were still dead! Fight? Against what? Your daddy, of course! You're telling me to fight the c c corruptorment My own father?! The time has come for you to make a decision, Rascal. If you choose to die here, I won't stop you. If you choose to live and prove you exist, then come with me. I... 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 But you lost, so you're just in denial. That's not very final boss-like. You're wrong! As long as I don't admit it, the fact that I allegedly lost doesn't exist. Have it your way. I shall simply be forced to destroy you over and over again. What? Until you admit defeat, I will use every ounce of power I possess to destroy you hundreds of thousands of times. Oh, hundreds? Thousands? Don't underestimate my persistence. I'll give you the real Hades treatment until your soul is broken. Over and over, forever! Oh, forever? Uh, uh, and w w what would such a tyrant be up to now? What is your objective? Hmm. I thought you'd never ask. Right here, see? On the second line on this article, there's a typo right here. I can't do anything. I'm such a powerless demon. I failed all of my tasks. And as death, I've never even taken anyone's life. Yeah, that's right. I'm a complete failure. That is absolutely correct. Good job! You've got yourself down pat! That's an impressive self-analysis. You deserve praise for that. What are you? Monsters? Let him finish what he has to say. Oh. So, you will become a full demon on your own merits, Rascal. Do you promise right here, right now? Promise, huh? I gotta keep any promises I make, right? Otherwise, I... That's right. Otherwise, you will learn the full weight of a promise through severe pain. Will you still make that promise? I can, and I will! I will become a great demon all on my own! Good. That's what I like to hear, Rascal. Now become an official member of our party, and fight to usurp the regime in time. You'll be able to challenge your father for superiority. Plus all other illegally obtained profit. I'm here to collect a grand total of 1,192,296 health. Uh, dude. You! That awkwardly placed dude. You're not a real Prinny, are you? You can't deceive an experienced Prinny instructor with that boss! Reveal yourself! <laughs> you are correct. Not bad. There's 
there's an angel inside that Brinny? Could she be the angel of Avarice? That's just the stupid nickname that some demons gave to me without my consent. You can call me... How about... Volcanus? Oh, could you? What are you doing in the Netherworld? I, I, th I thought you died! Artina! Hey, what's with the long face? Tired? Ate too many sardines? Got sardine balls stuck in your teeth? I'm not tired. I could never eat too many sardines. And the bones have already been taken care of. I'm just thinking over some things. Can you be quiet for a while? Think thinking things over? You? Have you ever done anything that wasn't spontaneous? This isn't like you. <laughs> oh, I know what you've got. The L word. Yeah, leprosy. No, Sid, no. Being said, what do you think, my lord? Mid-level demons. That may actually require a bit more effort this time. The Corruptorment has put a bounty on our heads after our invasions of the Plebeians and the Information Bureau. Bounty, huh? Interesting. So, how much are we worth? Ten thousand hell, my lord. Ten thousand? That's all? Those bastards! How could they? It'll make them regret putting such a low bounty on us? Their goals are completely different from one another. That doesn't matter. No matter our goals, there's only one path we each can take. We are more united than ever. To fulfill each of our goals, and to usurp the regime, let us bring the bourgeoisie under our control! Do you, Valsy? There used to be this machine where you had to catch a giant hammer, a hydrochloric acid swimming pool, and other serious facilities. I'm assuming that along with the corruptment, this training ground has become a joke of its former self. Okay then. I'll call you Fen Fen. Fen Fen? <laughs> I haven't seen anyone walk all over you like that in quite a while. I find it quite amusing. It wouldn't hurt to get to learn about human beings by befriending them. Whoa! I was so absorbed in all the nickname talk that I didn't even notice they found us! What a warm welcome. I'm starting to like being treated as a bounty. <laughs> What did you say? I am not allied with any angel. I'll proudly admit all of the evil doings that I've done, but I won't admit to anything that I don't remember doing, good or bad. We already knew that the Corruptorment has always used such cheap tactics. This is no surprise to me. However, I can't help but feel a little hopeless when even these mid-level demons are foolishly falling for their propaganda. Please. Be an example for them by fighting against the Corruptorment as the most exemplary demon of all. Splendid idea. I shall show them what a fighting Prinny instructor can do. <laughs> <laughs>